Welcome back! A couple things to get through real quick before I start. First of all, this week saw the release of patch 3.3.3.3.3.3.3. Now I already went over a lot of the new changes uh, a few episodes ago, and I'm not going to hash it all out again. So if you would like a recap, or you just happen to call the underside of a rock your home, uh, just check back a few episodes for the one titled patch 3.3.3.3.3.3. <laughs> Alright, let's move on to today's topic. One issue that every guild has to deal with at some point, especially around this time in content release where, you know, we're most of the way through an instance and people are getting kind of tired of it, is burnout. Everyone's seen it happen to somebody at some point. They just get so tired of playing the game for however many hours on a given week that they just stop showing up for whatever reason. Maybe they tell you, maybe they just disappear, who knows. Either way, they're not playing anymore and it's because they got tired of playing World of Warcraft. So then it stands to reason that more than a handful of guildmasters would like to know the answer to the question, how do I keep people from burning out? Survey says, you can't! So there you go, that's all for this week, goodbye. Okay fine, there's some things you can do. One of the biggest tips I can give there is don't over farm old content. Old War was a lot of fun the first 50 times I cleared it. When your raiders start going, ugh, Coliseum, the same way that a film critic might go, ugh, Polly Shore, uh, it's time to move on. And maybe somebody still has an upgrade sitting back there that just never dropped for them or whatever. But at some point you just gotta say, look, I'm not gonna drag everybody who's done that play so many times that at this point they'd rather beat their own mother with a plunger through there again just so that you can get your one little upgrade. It's simply not worth it to burn out the people with the gear so that someone else can get a small upgrade. Now that can still be the case even if there isn't enough content otherwise to fill up your, your entire raid schedule. If you raid five days a week, you spend four of them on Ice Crown and everything's dead in there, you don't need to drag everybody back to Ulduar to fill up the fifth day. In fact, giving people a day off every once in a while really isn't a bad thing at all, especially if you're worried about burnout. In fact, one of the biggest reasons that players in the absolute top-end world-first guilds can manage to play as much as they do without getting burned out is because of time off. And yeah, maybe they're raiding 20 hours a day, 10 days a week for a little while, but they progress through the instances quickly enough that they get past that relatively quickly and then all they have is a couple days of farming. Now obviously that's a very small minority of the overall player base, so for the rest of us you kind of have to force those breaks every once in a while. Also, make sure you're not sticking too much responsibility on one person. Occasionally you'll come across somebody who's just a monster and can handle absolutely everything and could run the whole guild themselves if they needed to, but those people are pretty rare. For we mere mortals, that's quite a bit to expect out of somebody. Don't pile too much on one person's shoulders. All you're going to do is turn the game into work for them and then they're not going to be all that interested in playing it anymore. Now all that being said, you really can't stop burnout from happening. At the end of the day, WoW is a game, just like any other game, and people get bored of playing the same game over and over and over and over again. Even in an MMO, eventually you're going to get tired of playing it, and you're going to want to do something else with your time, and for a lot of people that means they stop raiding. At that point, all you can really do is pick up some new people to fill in the gaps they leave behind. It sucks, but that's what happens. All right. That's all I have for today. I will see you guys next week, once again, on the Weekly Marmot.